boy. We got us new lighting in this motherfucker. All right. Got my mini baby biscuit ass. Hold up, hold up. Let me move this over a little bit. Bam, bam, nigga. Mini baby biscuit ass, nigga. Let's go. That's me. All right. So, today, boys and girls, we have a Smash Bros. Little play gameplay thing. Um, this is a really fight, good fight between me as Villager and my boy Joker. Um, I guess he's been on that MK Leo swag, so he really been, you know, wanting to be like, you know, the Joker main. It's like, cause it seems as though the Joker is the new Sheik. If that makes any sense. Um, by the way, in the comments, let me know if you guys like the lighting in the back. I got to have it like this. I have it like this. I kind of like it like that the best, just to be real. That way you guys can still see my whole face. But, okay. Back to what we were talking about. It seems like Joker has become the new MK... Le I mean, not that. Has become the new Sheik. Like, because Sheik was just a... I can't kill you at 50%, but I can not rack you up to 300 and then kill you. And everybody loved Sheik because she was so, I guess, diverse. And I never really saw it. Sheik was so good for some reason. All the time, Zero played the living fuck out of her. And I just, I never realized why Sheik was so good. I just, I didn't like Sheik. I just, I never realized how fucking, she's not really all that good. Um, but with that being said, you know, Joker comes out and he's like Sheik 2.0. Where I can do everything that Sheik does, but I have a stand. And that's basically what that is. And it's, it's crazy because all it took was this man to get a little power boost. Um, now, I'm not expecting Joker to get any nerfs anytime soon. Hell no. Um, obviously, Sakurai loves this man. He's like the new fucking Bayonetta. He's going to be top tier for a hot, hot ass minute unless he nerfs Arsene's damage. And like I said, that's not going to happen. Um, but with that being said, um, I... I don't mind Joker. I really like Joker. I just could never find myself to be good with him. I had to play someone who either does constant damage, has a decent constant damage, a a a reliable up B, and what I mean by reliable is it gets you back to the stage. None of that bullshit. And um, constant damage, a reliable up B, and I don't have to rely on like some type of gimmick most of the time. Like um, for example, Incineroar. And Shinroar is one of those champions where you don't really need a gimmick. The only thing that he really does is, I taunt in between my smash attacks because I'm the shit. Like, that, that's really it. Um, If you guys haven't noticed, also, I'm trying to work on my commentary. If you have any ops, any way to help me out, please let me know in the comments below. I'm going to watch some videos on it. I don't know. Damn, that looks so much better when you can't see that light. Like, look, look at the shit. Look at the shit. Look at the, oh, man, the sun. Oh, my God, it's so bright. And then you... Now, maybe if I do this. But then it looked too dark. Oh, shit. I mean, I kind of fucked it up. But you know what? It's all right. It's all right. We... Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Man, this video is, like, really unprofessional. But I really hope y'all are enjoying this fight, though. Uh, should that fight... This fight lit. <laughs> Anyways, um... But, yeah. That's just my personal opinion. If you're like, if you like Joker a lot, please let me know in the comments below. Um, what do you like about him? You know, I mean, I just, I, I like him. I think he's cool, but he's only cool when Arsene's here. Um, and that's, that's the thing that just that that's what that's the thing that makes him different than any other character, I guess. Um, uh, man, this is wild. This is a wild ass fight, man. Just watching this shit again. Holy shit. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Damn! Oh, I remember that shit. Oh, I fucked up. Ah! Alright, so I guess, you know, two for one ain't bad. You know, two, two vitties and one vitty. Um, basically, I, I. Okay, I'm a hero main. Now, that's with me saying, you know, I don't like Sheik or, you know, Joker. Only reason I like Hero a lot um, is because he's just he's different. I don't I don't like the the casual playing the same way every time. And Hero makes you change the shit up. It makes you have to be different. You don't have a choice. You have to play depending on what you get. You have to play at you know in harm's way. You always got to be worried about something. 
ain't shit always gonna be the same. I'm not the best hero in the world, no, but one day I do want to be known as one of the best heroes. I want to be one of those guys that can like fight you and then mid drive see something on this map, see something on the um on the um on the shit on the select thing, and then immediately on the spell select and then immediately just whop your ass. Like, oh my god, how did you see Kamikaze that fast? You know what I mean? Like, that's just something I want to work on. Um. But, yeah, I really like him. As for Banjo and Kazooie, I think they're broken. Not really broken. They're balanced. That's really it. Banjo and Kazooie are extremely balanced characters. They're not broken as fuck. They're not busted as hell. They're just extremely fucking balanced. Um, they have one broken-ass move. Um, they have a cool-ass gimmick to where they... Uh, that, that's their cool-ass gimmick as well. Um, they can move out of their up B, cool as fuck. Um, to me, it's like they're a, what's the word? He's like a, he's like a, like a Mario. Yes, you can say, or, yeah, he's like a Mario. Like, he can do everything well, but there's one thing he can do better than anyone, and that's fucking side B. <laughs> like, um, any... I guess you could say any fucking, every Mario is really good at up tilting, so it's for 15 years, you know, and then you look at every fucking banjo and they're like side being every 14 fucking seconds. Oh, I remember why I say this, because this is a good ass fight. I I think I won this. And I, oh, you know them games, those really close games where you win, and you're like, let's go, bitch ass, and you start throwing shit like, Motherfucker! You know, that's how I felt when I did that. Cause I, um, that's how I felt when I, I think I won this, if I'm not mistaken. But, cause it was one thing I could have lost. I had no mana. I, I'm not, yeah, I have no mana. And I did something. No, I think I had mana. Oh, right here. I was trying to stall out time for, um, my fireball because I didn't want to go up and hit him. Because, you know, I'm high as fuck. He could literally kill me at any moment. I'm like, yo, I'm just trying to stall for my fucking fireball. And every time I got knocked off stage or something like that, that would stop me. I felt, I was like, fuck, no, fuck, come on, fuck, no, fuck. And I was like, please, please. And I was like, okay, got his ass. And I was like, yeah, 38. Mana, let's go. Oh, fuck. I was, and then I was like, well, that's game. And then my inner don't give up nigga came out. And I was like. Fuck this shit! I'm not done yet! Ah! 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 